My research group uses synthetic biology principles to genetically program human cells for therapeutic applications. Upon microencapsulation and implantations into the body, these designer cells connect to the bloodstream, sense specific disease or infection markers, process this information and produce protein therapeutics at the right time and the right dose. The combination of in situ production, timing and dosing makes designer cell-based therapies superior to classical small molecule based treatment strategies and so offers new opportunities to diagnose, prevent and cure currently intractable diseases. For example, such living cell therapies could offer a new alternative to antibiotics for life-threatening bacterial infections. The emergence of antibiotic-resistant bacteria has become a new public health threat. Once biofilm infections are established, conventional antibiotics are no longer effective. Patients need to undergo repeated surgical procedures to remove the infected tissues and potentially the device along with extended period of antibiotic treatment. To address this issue, we have engineered an immune-like cell which can diagnose, prevent and cure biofilm infections. And these cells are programmed by a closed-loop gene circuit to sense and destroy Staphylococcus in a self-sufficient manner. So, how did we achieve that? In this study, instead of using the detect, deflect, and destroy policy employed by toll-like receptors from our innate immunity, we applied a direct sense and destroy strategy by rewiring the bacteria sensing capacity of toll-like receptors to the expression of a highly effective antimicrobial that kills bacteria immediately upon sensing. Such a closed-loop gene circuit was shown to equip mammalian cells with fast and effective anti-infective properties that are otherwise unrealizable. Cells harboring this synthetic gene circuit were then encapsulated into microcapsules to protect them from host immune reaction. The microencapsulated cells were then transplanted into mice for in vivo testing. Here we use the tissue cage infection mice model to simulate human implant associated infections. Mice were implanted with a tissue cage which is prone to bacterial biofilm infection. Microencapsulated immune like cells were then implanted into the cage of each mouse either before or after bacterial infection. And the result shows that our designer cells could not only diagnose infection, but also prevent the infection from occurring at the first place. Furthermore, we showed that our cells was able to cure 100% of bacterial infections and biofilm formations in mice. Our study provides the first of its kind cell-based therapy for diagnosis, prevention, and cure of one of the planet's most devastating bacterial pathogen. And we hope within the next 10 years to bring this study into human clinical trials and to provide a new way to tackle infections and antibiotic resistance. <laughs>